Let's move to the next question. Here, if two circles are drawn, taking two sides of triangle has diameter, we have to prove that the point of intersection of these circles lie on the third side. That means we are given a triangle by taking any two sides, circles are drawn. Let this be a circles. And here the diameters of these circles are the sides. And we have to prove that the point of intersection of these two circles lie on the third side. So let's prove this. Here we have a triangle ABC and circles with diameter AC and BC. Let the point of intersection of these two circles be D. And when we join CD, we have to prove that D lies on AB. So here we note down the given data and we have to prove that D lies on AB. Now consider the triangle with diameter BC. Here we note that we form a triangle BDC. In this triangle, it forms in semicircle of this circle. Therefore, angle of any triangle in semicircle is right angle. Therefore, angle BDC is equal to 90 degrees. Similarly, in this triangle with diameter AC, we have a triangle ADC. And here also, angle in semicircle is 90 degrees. So, we have angle ADC which is 90 degrees. So, by using this, we prove the given problem. And we have two triangles ADC and BDC and they are right angle triangle at D. Therefore, we have angles ADC is a right angle and BDC it is also right angle. It is because angle in semicircle is right angle. So by adding these two we get angle ADC plus angle BDC we get the sum has 180 degrees. Therefore, we can say that AB including D forms a straight line because angle formed by a straight line is 180 degrees and ADB is a straight line so D lies on AB and this completes our solution.